Well, good morning, Sasquatch watchers. Um, it looks like uh, we got more sand than we had before, so we're probably sanded in. We're still going to give it a shot. And we'll go, go through the water. The waves are just tiny. I don't mind being a little wet. We had uh, Hurricane Ian go through. Um, I feel real bad for the people of Fort Myers and down south of here. Uh, they got hit really, really bad. If you can support them, please support them. Um, we uh, got a lot of wind, some rain, no lightning. Um, we just basically had a sustained tropical storm with pretty high winds. But uh, I'm going to get out there and see if something got washed in and not covered up. Sand might have got tossed around. So I'll bring you back when I get fired up and I get to the water. All right, let me just take a minute and show you how pretty the beach is. The water is kind of chocolatey from being all turned up. But the itty bitty waves, it's pretty flat. No, you can't see it with GoPro, but straight out from here, I see a sailboat with two sails. There's a pelican over there. There's one diving. Uh, so there's bait fish along the shore. Um, boy, it's pleasant out here. It's maybe 71 degrees with a very slight breeze coming out of the east. Uh, it's, it's nice, even though I'm just picking up garbage. Uh, you know, any day at the beach is a good one. So, all right, I'll bring you back when I actually find something. Oh, did you see the pelican dive? That's always cool. You know, let me tell you, my, everybody doesn't like pelicans a lot, but, you know, they're pretty amazing. I used to work at a 17-story uh, building when I was doing construction. Watch some things climb, 17 stories. See a fish, fold back their wings, and dive head first into the water with their mouth open. My gosh, that's tough, if nothing else. So, okay, enough chitter chatter, let's go and uh, find stuff. Well, I'm getting a 20, 21, 23, up to 26, penny maybe? Might be a whole can. <laughs> it's pretty deep and it's really loud. I want to give it a couple more scoops here. I want to call it a can and move on. on the mic can't even tell you what vintage it is. I think it's a new no, yeah, new penny. That could be wrong. Nineteen. Hang on. Seventy-nine. Seventy-four. Seventy-six. Nineteen seventy-eight. It's copper. That's why it was ringing up so good. Okay. Let's see if that other thing is still there. No, it was I was just off on it. So, all right, fill this in and keep cruising down the beach like I have been. I guess I had my, uh, forgot to turn it off. Anyway, penny sound. Let's see what we got. I thought it would still be down there. if we can get it this way. 
Nope, still down there. Huh, let's pinpoint it. Okay, we're just off a little bit. I think we moved it. I think we moved it. I'll get you the date on the wrap up. Okay, go in the hole, move down the beach. Chris, you can tell they got the big heavy speed. Beach, anyway, they're new beach detectors. It's kind of heavy. And, uh, I'm not sure what kind of detector. It looks like a pretty decent detector. Looks like she found a tent stake. Welcome to the world of metal detecting on the beach. So, okay, I wish them the best. All right, I'm picking up a 11 or a 12. About here. Let's see if we can get it on a short scoop. Nope, oh, still down there. Hard pack. Uh, we moved it, so that's good. back off of a uh, some sort of a pan or something cool all right now what we need to do is find the pan maybe I'll spiral out see if I can find that all right spiral one I'm getting a 20, 21, so it's a penny sound. And a penny sound hole. Okay, here's out of the hole. There it is. Right there, a little bit of roundness. Roundness in the hole. And it is. It's Lincoln. I don't know, I think it's a shield penny, maybe. Yeah, I think that's a shield penny. Okay, in the pouch. Bring it home. Alright. I'm continuing down the beach. 
appear to be getting a seven or an eight, but holy smokes, it's way down there. Up to a twelve. Let's see if I can pinpoint it. Doesn't work so good. Whoo! That was all the wave. Not all. The, okay, I'm gonna leave that one. I'm going back up on the water because they're hitting me. I'm getting really wet, <laughs> and that wasn't my goal today. Get another tone here. It's gone from 16 to 9, and all in between. Chirping and everything. I might have it. Let's see. <laughs> That's an oldie but a goodie. That's a bottle cap. I can tell you what brand it is, it's old. Turn it upside down, get sand out of it. There it is. Oh, well, it's a green one. It's one of those with the tree on it. I might have to try one of those. I find a few of them. Maybe that's the one thing I'll do is start. I'm not a big drinker, but I like a beer every now and then. I'm a Jaeger fan. They don't do that much either. Uh, Maybe what I'll start doing is trying some of these beers from Beer Cap. But you can bet darn sure I won't leave the cap on the beach. Okay, off forward we go. Penny, dime, dime. I didn't have to dig. So oh, there's one. Here, I'll show it to you. Ain't much to look at. I just think it's just, that's a, one of them. Uh, Zinc pennies. This one's definitely a dime. There's a dime. And another dime. That's almost cheating. Huh? And a pull tab right up on the surface. <laughs> okay. Oh, I see another one on the surface. Goodness gracious. Another dime. Another dime. Is this it right here? Okay, now I'm getting spoiled. Oh, this one's way down. Okay. Try to pinpoint her. I think I'm on it. I'm just deep. I 
<laughs> All right, let's just try. Oh, hold on, I see it. I think I see it. Or a juice box or something. Near that, the beach colors have just got to me. That's my scoop. There's something right there. That's a shell. Okay, finally got it out of the hole. There it is, right there, another penny. It's a shield penny. Uh, but I had another signal over here. It says 14. Okay. Boy, that one tired me out. Okay. Okay, I give up. <laughs> I don't usually give up that easy. I'm tired. All right, I'll bring you back. Got a wind-blown beach. Can you tell which way the wind was blowing? I think it was that way. Oh, I'm getting ready to head up to where the cabanas usually are and walk straight down through there. So, see you in a few. Okay, I was checking a signal. Look what I found right there. Look. It's a quarter. Shoot, spent all this money on metal detector. Find stuff on the surface. <laughs> Just kidding. It's definitely a quarter. 
Yeah, it's a state quarter, but I can't tell you which one. All right. The thing I found was over here. There's a tone. Let's see what's right there. Still there. Wow. This thing is still down here somewhere. Let's go across it. Goodness. Tell. Well, there's a plastic lid. We'll get it off the beach. Where did the gun go? Okay. Okay, I think I got it. It goes to the scoop, it's one of the little button things. So, I think it's a lead. No, it's a little clip thing. Off of something. I think it's for like the cabanas. Okay, I'm done with my spiral now. Okay, I see a sand dollar right there. But I think this one's alive. Came down in the sand, burying itself. I'm pretty sure. I don't know if you can see it. Its little legs are moving. And the fact that it's pushing up into the sand, we're going to go put it in the water. I'm glad I found one alive. Let's set this up. That way, somebody won't pick up one of the live ones. Just walk it out. Cute little fellow. I'll rinse him off and show you before I put him down in the water. Water's cool. Okay. That's what he does. Those little purple stuff. That's usually good name too. It's uh, uh live. I'll catch you in a bit. We're doing this again. The dime. A dime, a dime. I think the tooth fairy crash landed out here or something in the hurricane. Three times. And I, I, I found it with the detector, but I didn't have to dig. I got another signal over here. Oh, I think I kind of see it. No. See if this is it right here. Now it's down a little further. It's a penny sound. And it's in the scoop. There it is. I don't know what it is. It's always one of those fancy little caps. Okay, could have been a penny. See this? Here's one I don't have to dig. Mike's. So you guys know these guys had a tough go of it, I'm sure. Didn't get much to eat for a couple days. They look pretty tired and haggard. Or 
resting up here. I'm trying not to disturb them because I think they've been hunkering down and need some rest. Poor little guys. Here's uh, terns and seagulls all here. So I'm, I'm heading back down that way. And if you look over there, that's where Publix is. That's kind of how I know where to get back. They took down all the the bouncy rides and stuff and took them in. So uh, we're still recovering here. We didn't get hit real bad, but you know, got to get back to normal. Catch you on the next find. Okay, I think this is the last time I'm going to dig down here in the wet, and I'm going to go up on the beach because they've removed all the benches, and I'm, that way it'll give me a clearer shot. So before they put them back, I'm getting a seven or an eight right here. Let's see what we got. <coughs> First scoop. I can see it. Here's another pull tab. No, that's a shell. I got something. That's what I thought it was. What do we got here? Where are you? Where you go? Okay. Oh, there it is. I'm pretty sure. It's just a hunk of metal. A little bit of can slaw. Yep. We'll look at it closer when we get home. Make sure it ain't nothing. Always check your finds. Okay. Before you throw them away. Let me just fill back in. I'll show you what we're going to do on our next phase of this thing. Walk up the beach. I'm thinking a lot of the sand's been blown around. There's a little cut down here. Let's uh, walk through that first. Looks like a little bit of erosion anyway. I'll show you. You see where it's kind of cut through here. And it's washing back down. We'll give that a shot. And then if you look, they're putting their cabanas back up. But down here they haven't. So I'm gonna, I know about where they're at, so I'm going to go down there and hit it without the stuff being there. Okay, here we go. Morning, Squatch Watchers. I just got the video edited for... Uh, the hunt after Hurricane Ian and I don't have any wrap-up material um, there must not have been anything very good it was a good hunt I uh, got to see a lot of stuff got out there a few days after the hunt because uh, I'm critical where I work so I had to be at work helping folks out and uh, I my heart goes out to the people of Fort Myers in that area um, seems like they're you know, right now we're in April 2023 is when I'm filming this and they're recovering they're still not fully recovered but they're making their way uh, so anyway I hope you enjoyed the video sorry about no wrap up um, if you would please hit the like button if you haven't subscribed please subscribe um, again I'm going to start trying to put out more of these videos and I've got a ton of material. I've just got to take time to sit down and uh, put it out the, the content. So, like I said, I hope you enjoyed it. I thank you for your uh, comments, views, and support. Uh, by the way, my last video uh, with Lady Squatch, um, man, it just went off the hook to uh, 70 or 80,000 views. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of people thought it was an actual Sasquatch or a female Sasquatch that killed a deer, but no, it was my wife. So anyway, uh, enjoy the video, and uh, until next time, God bless.